don't wipe back to front. Cause you're gonna ruin your life. You're gonna ruin your life. Hold up. What's up, party people? It's your girl Lex, and I am back with another banger. Okay, like I'm just coming through with the videos. Y'all better give me props, okay? Okay, so thank you so much for clicking on my video. If you are returning, what's up? You already know how we get down here. And if you are new, thank you so much for watching my video. Go ahead and click the subscribe button, or you know, you can wait, you know, till. You see that we're really lit here and then you can subscribe so we can get right into this video so this video today is going to be like a hygiene product haul for men and women so i'm going to give you some of my tips some of the things i do for women um and then just some stuff for men that things that y'all don't do that y'all need to do okay because yeah some of y'all be really walking around here stink okay um so the first thing i have for my face is first thing i have for my face is survey this is what I use on my face. This thing is fire, okay? When I tell you fire, fire. And guys, you guys need to wash your face too. It's not just a girl thing. Like Y'all need to wash your face too. And then also get you a face brush. But get you like a face brush, like one of them sonic brushes. Get you one of those, bruh. Changed my life. Also exfoliate. This is the exfoliator I have. There you go. This is what I got. Okay, so that's the one I have. You can make an exfoliator, whatever, but you really need to exfoliate because it gets in your pores. Like, that's something that's really important. And for guys, you guys, like, some of y'all be walking around with them little bumps and stuff all in your nose. Like, they're not cute. Hygiene is a big thing for girls. And if a guy does not take care of his face... What are you doing, baby? Like, come on. Like, you gotta... You gotta do your face too. You can't just hop in the shower and hop out. Like, it don't work like that. Like, you, just like girls, like, you're the same thing. You're the same thing. You're human, just like us. You need to wash your face. Um, I say to do this once a day, at nighttime mostly, because that's when, after a long day, you've been sweating, da da da, makeup, whatever. It's fully it. This gets you one of these. Get you one of these, Target. I think I got this for $20 at Target. 20 or 30, something like that. But this right here, this is a safe haven. This shit works. I use it for my stretch marks. I use it for, cause um, I have high hyperpigmentation on my face. Nobody ever notices but me, but it's there. And I have uneven skin tone. Like my skin is so uneven. But this right here, listen. This this is the truth. This is the truth. So get you. It's called bio oil. This works miracles. Okay. As a um, moisturizer, you can use coconut or as an oil. You can use coconut oil. This is a straight extra virgin coconut oil or African shade. This you can't put a lot because it's really greasy. But this right here discoloration dry skin if you have eczema this right here is the truth let me show you face mask you gotta do a face mask this i actually tried this aztec's clay mask if you have me on instagram you've seen that i did it and it was not <laughs> it was messed up i'm gonna show you the picture right here it's like i put it all over i put it on my face up on my hair but you can put this on your face and your hair and this I wouldn't say to do this all the time though, because it's very strong. I'd say to do it probably once or twice a month. Like, I, you don't need to do it all the time. This, I didn't really see, like, my face was clean. Like, you know, it felt nice, but it was, it was I. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have to try it again, because I didn't do it right. But I heard really good stuff about this. So if you have someone, if you're someone that has a lot of acne, a lot of black marks, a lot of stuff like that, Get you this Aztec clay mask. Face mask, okay? Mind you, I ran it up in Target. All this stuff I got from Target besides the shea butter. I got from Target and I ran it up in there. I spent like over $300 on y'all for this video. And y'all probably not even gonna watch it. But anyways, look. All this stuff, all these face masks, I got... I'm gonna do one today, actually. I wanna do a um, relaxing mask today. 
but I also have leaf patches for under my eyes because I always have bags under my eyes. No matter how much I sleep, I always have bags. Guys, too, like you guys need to do face masks too. Y'all can do face masks too. I don't know what it is, but some of y'all don't be cleaning y'all ears. And <laughs> ever since I was a kid, if I, I don't care how much I liked you, if I looked in your ears by an accident and it was dirty, I don't even like you no more. Like, I just lose all types of feelings for you. So make sure y'all clean your ears, clean behind your ears, clean all of that because y'all, I don't know what y'all be doing. Some of you guys really don't do that. And I just don't get it why. Some girls too, some of y'all is dirty. Like, <laughs> some of y'all is real dirty. Make sure you clean in your ears. Like, clean your ears. If you ever see me and you see my ears dirty, let me know. Everybody always asks me, like, how come my teeth is so white? Da 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 da. I use, it's in the bathroom, I use baking soda and peroxide Colgate. I think that's what it's called. And I used to scrub my teeth with baking soda, um, but ever since I got braces and I have, like, a retainer inside, the baking soda messes up with the retainer glue, so it's gonna come out, basically. It basically deteriorates the glue. And get you one of these spin brushes. It's a spin brush. Yeah, this one's from Oral B. Also, something that a lot of you do not do. When you brush your teeth, you don't just brush your teeth. You brush your tongue too. Some of y'all don't know to brush your tongue. You're supposed to brush your tongue, bro. Brush your tongue. That's very important. Brush your tongue, brush your teeth, and don't just go that's it. No, you gotta brush that shit because that's where all the bacteria sits on. It sits on your tongue. It don't sit on nowhere else. It sits on your tongue. Your teeth is just for plaque and leftover food. But all the, the bread, breath, all the stuff is on your tongue. Okay? Brush your tongue religiously. Like, religiously. Always brush your tongue. I can't stand to see somebody with a white tongue. White my tongue be all white, yellow, brown, and like type of shit are you on next under pits shaving 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 y'all need to shave y'all under pits guys nah i'm playing i'm playing y'all need to shave but sh some of y'all be stank like that shit is not cute at all it's not cute like y'all need to put deodorant on y'all need to do something because i don't know what Y'all got going on, but y'all need to do that. And then girls, keep your underpants shaved. Like, I be seeing some girls on Instagram who don't shave. That's how you stink more, my guy. Keep it, keep it shaved, sweetheart. Keep it shaved. And a good deodorant to use is the deodorant from Dove, the spray ones. Always use the spray ones because when you use the other ones, the stick ones, it leaves, like, it leaves, it makes your underpants have, like, a weird weird feeling a sticky feeling and then you gotta go in the shower and you gotta scrub that bad boy like you have to scrub it off literally i mean you're supposed to do that anyways but when you put the thing on there the roll whatever you have to scrub it and that shit is a buzz that is such a buzz like i hate the feeling i can't i can't deal with that i can't deal with it so shaving your kitty cat or waxing your kitty cat whatever you do make sure you exfoliate dove has an exfoliator it's this. I haven't tried this one yet, but I'm going to try it. I've been using Tree Hunt. Really, really good. I like them too. But before you shave, exfoliate, 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 exfoliate. And then there's this new razor I got from Flamingo. If you watch one of my old videos, I had did a wax with Flamingo. I did not like their wax at all, at all. But their the razor is really, really good. I love this razor. Like it's super soft. The head is soft. It has five blades. It moves with you. Like everything. This is a plus. I use these. I have these just in case I run out, like a backup. But it don't really matter. They have a, a moisturizing bar too. That's another thing. Get something with a moisturizing bar that have like the bars with moisturizer on it. I don't know how to explain it, but make sure you get that always. Get, don't ever get one of them regular two two um, razors or one razor or whatever. Don't ever get none, nothing like that. Good wax to do is this. And this one's not bad. It hurts. Like, they all, they all gonna hurt, sis. But 
this one's not that bad i like this one and then when you're done shaving or when you shave you can use coconut oil use coconut oil or really good too eos i really like eos my friend put me onto this this is really good so use coconut oil or use eos but what you would do is you'll let the coconut oil sit on your kitty cat you let it sit on there for probably like five minutes and then what what your hairs marinate and then you shave it and just make sure you shave down don't shave up unless you really really have to unless you really really got to it's an important time and you gotta do that do it but besides that don't don't shave down if anything shave across but shave down always dove sensitive or non-scented soap on the area what i'm talking about don't be trying to put no summer's eve don't be trying to put no dove no dove like this in there don't put nothing like scented sensitive skin only because it's sensitive down there get you a rag and clean in between your your lips that's it clean between your lips with the soap you don't have to use soap but if you want to use soap use soap but you use this soap put it in between the corners and the, the ends the creases whatever rinse it out as soon as possible do not put no soap inside there do not do not do not put soap up there at all and when you use in the bathroom make sure you wipe front to back don't wipe back to front because you're going to ruin your life you're going to ruin your life have like three rags have one of these to wash your body have one to wash your vagina and have one to wash your butt do not use the same rag to wash your butt to wash your vagina don't do that and make sure and some of y'all guys y'all need to be washing y'all butt y'all need to wash your balls and wash your butt because some of y'all is dirty y'all go outside playing on ball all day come inside and lay down and go to sleep don't go and wash your, your body what well, like what type of timing are you on y'all need to bathe like guys girls everybody need to bathe twice a day take a shower twice a day one in the morning one at night i don't care what you say i don't want to hear no oh i took a shower last night are you stupid you sweated all night you sweated all night and now you're not gonna take a shower until the next night that's dirty you gotta take a shower in the morning because you sweated all night you sweated everything out so now you're gonna be sitting in your sweat so you're gonna take a shower when you get up. Then you're gonna take a shower at night because you sweated all day. You sweated all day. Your balls is sweaty. Your vagina is sweaty. Your butthole is out of control. And make sure y'all is scrubbing your butt, bro. Make sure you scrub your butt. Get in there and just scrub it. Scrub it. Scrub that shit, okay? And <laughs> I seen this TikTok where it was like. Y'all be um spreading your butt cheeks out and letting the water flow through it. Yes, that's how you're supposed to clean your butt. <laughs> that had me dead, okay? That's how you're supposed to clean your butt. What are you talking about? Now, shaving your legs. Y'all don't be washing your legs in the shower. You don't wash your legs. You just let the water run down. That's dirty. That's dirty. You're dirty. You need to seek help because you're dirty. If you're about to shave, exfoliate your legs. Okay, exfoliate them before you shave and after you shave, right? Get from angle because you you will not like you won't thank me later. Get from angle, right? You gonna shave it, right? Shave it, shave it, whatever. Um, exfoliate it. Then let me t let me put y'all on. You can get this. This makes your legs so soft. You gonna get this? Listen, when I tell you this is the goat, it's the goat okay it's the goat this right you're gonna put that on you're gonna put that on you're gonna put that on right and then when you got the shower this this all right put that on okay but if not if not you get you this this stuff fire see i don't really like using lotion like this i usually use like shea butter or baby oil but this right here this has been I'm gonna hold you it comes it comes out nice and just soft and it smells so good so I, I put y'all on if they ask me to put y'all on i put y'all on if you don't want to shave your legs and you want to do a um 
you want a nair this right here i seen this on the commercial and i was like bet i gotta try it i gotta try it i gotta try it i'm telling you it's like a leg mask right and it's a charcoal leg mask right that's like a leg mask so when you're done you're gonna put it all over and then when you're done you're just gonna wash your wash it off shave your hair and it makes you have smooth ass legs okay smooth smooth and not only that if you have strawberries on your legs it get rid of strawberries like, who you know ain't nobody else put you on how i just put you on bro stop playing with me oil gel if you want to go out and you want to feel like the baddest little thing up in there put some baby oil on and it's up from there okay it's up it's up get you the one that smells like lavender but I had one that smelled like lavender sun. Somebody said, you smell like my baby mama. I was like, what? <laughs> Hold on. He was like, you smell, damn, you smell so good. You smell like my baby mama. I had to leave the scene. I had to leave the scene because you know what that means. I had to dip. I had to leave the scene. And for some of y'all boys who is not cut, you know what I'm saying? Y'all need to pull it back. I don't know if your mama ever told you, but you need to pull it back and clean it. Clean it. Clean it for me, okay? Clean it. Pull that little sucker back and clean it. Get you one of these. Sensitive Dove soap or non-scented soap. Use that to clean your little thing, all right? Pull it back, because y'all the main reason why girls be getting infections. It's y'all, like, it, it's y'all guys. Cause y'all don't know how to clean your stuff. And if you walk around with your balls itching, then you have a problem that you need to deal with. All right? Don't be trying to do this, that, and a third when you have a problem down there, okay? Cause when girls get BV, it's a bacterial vaginosis. You don't get that by yourself. You get that from guys. You get it from dudes, okay? Don't be ashamed, you get it from them. We get yeast infections from them. You get it, like, you know, if you use the wrong thing. But most, for the most part, you get it from guys, okay? Because they are dirty. All right, that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, to be honest. Um, I just wanted to give out some of the things that I'm going to try. And then let y'all know what y'all need to try. And what y'all dudes need to start doing. Taking a shower, washing your balls, pulling that thing back. Good. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, like it, comment, subscribe. Let me know how you feel. If you are new, if you didn't subscribe by now, there's something wrong with you. I think there's something wrong with you and you should probably get that checked out. Go ahead and click subscribe because there's no reason why you should have watched this whole video and not subscribe. It's kind of upsetting me and my homegirls. Okay. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you at my next party. Bye. Hold up.